I'm T.S. Decker, Command Sergeant Major, retired. Today on How To, we're going to go over transition shooting from your rifle to your sidearm. This is Military.com's How To. As always, I have Master Sergeant Retired Mike Cluck as my sidekick here and good friend. What we're going to do today is go over a series of transition drills from your rifle to your sidearm, very slowly, very safely. And as we practice them here, eventually, later today, we're going to go out to the range and do live oh. fire transition drills with the rifle and the pistol. Master Sergeant Cluck's going to make sure, like we always do on how to, we got a complete safe weapon. Being he's got a M4 platform, and a sidearm, he's gonna go through the procedure, make sure he's clear. Go ahead, Mike. Chamber's clear, weapon's on safe. Chamber's clear. Excellent, weapon's on safe. For the note, for the M9 sidearm, when we're doing our dry fire drills, after we make sure we got a complete safe weapon, we put it back in our holster with the weapon off safe. When we were back, on active duty doing what we had to do. Whenever we got any kind of white space, we'd bring our troops out and we go over dry fire drills. Why? Got to give them the competence and the confidence that be familiar with their weapon systems and make them better soldiers. So what we're going to do is today, Mike's going to come up on a target. He's going to squeeze around off. He's going to hear a click. That's a quick indicator that he's going to have to transition to his sidearm. So we're going to practice this real slow, real safe. Okay, stand by. When you're ready, Mike, just squeeze around real slow. Let the rifle come down. Transition to your sidearm. And holster. For this block, we're just going to do let the rifle hang, come out of his holster, and come up on target. Let's try it again. Ready, up. and holster. These are the drills we do over and over and over again to just get you in that flow. That way when we transition to the live fire range, we can build up our speed and confidence with it. Up. And holster. Once we get done in the conclusion of our dry fire drills with our rifle to our sidearm, we're gonna shift and go right up to the range and do this with live ammunition. For the first iteration, we're going to do a dry rifle run for a live pistol, which means Master Sergeant Clock is going to go up on an empty chamber, he's going to hear a click, and he's going to transition to his sidearm to do a controlled pair on the target. Shear ready, stand by. Up! Slow transition, come up. Decock. And holster. Okay. As you can see there, the transition. He comes up on gun target, click. Transition slowly and controlled, comes up on target, does a controlled pair. Now what we're gonna do, we're gonna load him up with a live rifle round. One shot with his rifle, a transition. Practice again, stand by. Shooter ready. Up. Decock and holster. Decock and holster. All right, we're gonna load you up with three rounds now, Mike. Give it three shots, get on target. Shooter ready, stand by. Up! Decock and holster. What we did was just a transition to make sure He's up on gun target, he engages, gets the fourth click on the fourth trigger pull, transitions to his sidearm, controlled pair. We do this methodically. Dry fire, we increment it up to live fire. This is what we do to transition shoot and practice it slowly and be safe. I'm T.S. Decker, this is military.com's How To.